Uh, Logan Longhorn's cheerleaders just went off, but I tell you who this is. This is the Highland Hornets Band of the Week. The Highland Hornets playing at Sweet Sounds in the stands. Yes, there it is. Hornets Band of the Week. Thank you, Highland Hornets, for the Sweet Sounds coming down on this night nice shift. Welcome back. A simple wish for the hometown crowd at Leon Williams Stadium in Clovis tonight. Win and end a four-game losing streak. A tough task indeed with the Artesia Bulldogs coming to town after suffering their first defeat last week. And look at it go. Kamal Cass for the Clovis Wildcats. Yeah, you better hit him hard to get him down because this man runs hard and he's got it again. Kamal Cass driving his team down the field. You know what they say about the third time. You saw two plays. Well, yeah, it's the charm. Cash making the move, cutting it back inside into the end zone, seven to nothing. Clovis, here comes Artesia, Trevor Eulenbach, looking, finding, Derek Chase. Yeah, he actually caught that. Did you see all the tips? Getting the Bulldogs close. Then this time it's Eulenbach again. His other receiver, Gavino Sice, into the end zone. Both teams exchanging scores. Cass, once again, the breakaway touchdown. He had six touchdowns, 366 yards in a loss. Artesia wins it, 55-48. to 48. Carlsbad Caveman at the undefeated Goddard Rockets want to thank Jerry and Rosal for giving us this highlight here. A fumble, and the Goddard would recover it, and they would also win after coming from behind, 20-17. to 17. Goddard is the final. Another team from Roswell, the Coyotes, got on the road to Moriarty while Estancia had the pleasure of hosting the undefeated and ferocious Santa Rosa Lions. All of this played out in the front of our own Alex Goldsmith. This is your first step toward a DC. You enter this season as the runner-up, people. We better finish it another way. You understand that? All right, let's go. It's that kind of speech that gets two-time defending 2A champ Santa Rosa ready to roll. But Estancia was chomping at the bit, too. Right here, baby, right here. Let's get it on. However, the Bears couldn't stop the Lions' ground game from the very beginning. Tim Valverde starts off the scoring with six. Then it's Marcus Lopez going for not just one touchdown, but how about two touchdowns? The speedy senior puts the Bears into hibernation. Everybody wake up and ball down. Come on. Let's go. Come on. One, two, three. Go. This was simply no contest at all. Santa Rosa remains unbeaten with a beatdown of the Bears. 51 to nothing, your final. <laughs> Just up Highway 47, Moriarty looking to defend its home turf against some howling Roswell Coyotes. 28 to 7 Pintos at half, and they keep their foot on the gas pedal with an onside kick. Moriarty's ball, and the fans love it. They also love Justin Manning. He plows his way in for six, and the gap gets worse for Roswell. But there's still some fight in these Coyotes. Next drive, David Nunez makes a cut and gets rolling. Chews up most of the field, but this is key. Does not get in. Moriarty's defense would hold, and on the next drive, Manning acting like a bowling ball again and coming up with another strike. The Pintos extend the lead. The defense would keep hitting hard, and 56 to 14 was your final score for Moriarty. Alex Goldsmith, KRQE News 13. Yeah, by the way, Manning had six touchdowns and 124 yards. The man earned his pay. Oh, yeah, just like Kamal Cass of Clovis. Time for a water break. The Thursday Rewind is on the way. And it's just the night that the Valencia Jaguars get into the win column. The Gallup Bengals may have something to say about it. Plus, it's Hilltoppers and Spartans and Bernalillo. Highlights coming up. First, check out our Player of the Week. This week's Football Friday Night's Player of the Week is Cleveland Storm running back Romel Jordan. The senior running back rushed for 193 yards and three touchdown scores on just 19 carries as the Storm beat Highland last week 49-6. The future Lobo also caught one touchdown pass, good for 50 yards in the win. Romel Jordan, you are this week's Football Friday Night's Player of the Week.